Hey guys, welcome to my channel as I bring you all the latest Manchester United news today. Today, I bring you Manchester United injury updates and transfer news all in this video. Do watch to the end and know all about it. Manchester United defender Brandon Williams have joined Ipswich Town on loan from Manchester United. The Manchester United defender joined Ipswich Town on a season-long loan. Meanwhile, Manchester United will be without their experienced left-back Luke Shaw, who is injured and said to be out for weeks. Luke Shaw picked up an injury during training and won't be fit for the match against Nottingham Forest. Meanwhile, also injured for Manchester United is Mason Mount. The English midfielder picked up an injury during the match against Tottenham, which will keep him out for weeks. So he won't be available for Manchester United for at least six weeks. According to reports, Manchester United are said to have agreed a deal with Fenerbahce for goalkeeper Alte Bayendi. The goalkeeper has already had a medical for Manchester United in Greece, but it remains to be known if the deal will be completed soon, as the deal depends on Dean Henderson leaving Manchester United. If all goes to plan, Alte Bayendi will be a backup goalkeeper to Andre Onana at Manchester United. The transfer fee agreed is said to be around £4.2 million for the goalkeeper. There are strong rumours regarding the return of Rasmus Hoyland from injury, but I want to tell you this, that Rasmus Hoyland is back from injury, truly, but he is not yet match fit, so he won't be available to face Nottingham Forest. So he is now working with the United doctors to see if he will get fit as soon as possible as he dreams of making his Manchester United debut anytime soon. According to reports, Manchester United are close to agreeing a deal with Rhys Sedar for Donny van der Beek. As we all know that Donny van der Beek has endured a slow start to Manchester United career ever since he joined Manchester United from Ajax. So he is looking to try a new challenge with Rhys Sedar, but Manchester United are still working with Rhys Sedar to agree on a particular fee that will see Van der Beek move to Rhys Sedar on a permanent deal. Also departed Manchester United as of today is Manchester United youngster Noam Emera, who joined FC Groningen from Manchester United for an undisclosed fee. The 20-year-old winger joined the Netherlands side FC Groningen from Manchester United on a permanent deal. Meanwhile, Sofian Amrabat deal is still on. The only reason why Manchester United move for Amrabat is not progressing is that they have not sold enough players to be able to sign Sofian Amrabat from Fiorentina. But according to reports, Manchester United have negotiated a deal with Fiorentina and they are still working on it as they look to see if Donny van der Beek or Scott McTominay will leave and they will not short to get Amrabat. Meanwhile, Manchester United are in the race for Brazilian striker Marcos Leonardo as they look to hijack the deal from Roma. The striker plays for Santos in Brazilian league. Though they have not made a bid yet, but they are considering the option as they want a backup striker for Rasmus Hoyland. I will let you know what happens next on this deal. So guys, that's all for now guys. Please don't forget to like, share and subscribe to my YouTube channel and stay tuned for more football news and updates as I promise to be bringing you Manchester United news and updates back to back. I love you all. Bye for now.